Welcome back to Levels Review, where we review your favorite and not so favorite levels. Banjo Kazooie has always been a series that has provided its audience with a diverse selection of worlds to experience. So far, we've seen the mountains, the beaches, and a creepy cavern. Each world offers their own unique experiences when it comes to picking the right vacation destination. And Hanny, do I have the vacation package for you in this video. Now I'll be honest, this isn't the best vacation package I've tried to sell, but god damn it I'm going to try. So pack your bug spray and get out your best camo and get ready to travel to Bubble Gloop Swamp. Now I know what you're thinking, who the hell would want a vacation in a swamp? And to that I'd say probably this family. Or this guy. But if that doesn't convince you, let's break down this world and go over every experience you could have. First off, in this world you can learn the Stilt Stride. This move allows you to strap on these designer boots and gives you the ability to strut your tall legs throughout the piranha filled swamp water. You've never looked better, baby. Now I'll be the first to admit that this world is not the most appealing. It's somewhat gloomy, way too much green, and just not the most exciting to navigate through. Truthfully, the two major ways to get through this world is with these sexy boots, or having a high level of balance. But life's about balance, right? And it's certainly the case if you like to collect jiggies, because for two of these jiggies, you must use your beak bust on the jiggy switches and cross these thin and narrow paths to collect jiggies within time constraints. But trust in your skill set, and you should be just fine. One thing I highly recommend doing early in your vacation is dropping off your stupid kids at this turtle daycare. It doesn't matter what your kid is, they will take kids of all creatures and sizes. Here they can also practice their musical ability, and if you decide to practice as well, you'll be awarded with a jiggy. But in order to even get access to this daycare, you have to smash Tank Tup's feet. This giant turtle is a godlike character in these swamps, but don't worry, he's also kinky and loves when tourists smash his feet. The harder the better, and if you do it well, you'll be awarded with another jiggy. Now that you're kid free, it's time to get crazy. One of Bubble <laughs> One of Bubble Gloop Swamp's best excursions is the colorful poisonous frogs. They are the swamp's national anthem, and they are also endangered, and so there are high penalties if they are injured. It's actually been a while since anyone has seen them, so we're thinking they might be hibernating right now, and definitely not extinct. Next, visit the local villagers and see the tree huts. This swamp gets its rich history from the locals, and they are the reason there is so much culture here. They are so loving and kind, and I know they've spent months building these huts, and so it would really be a shame if someone did something to disturb the peace. Remember Tank Tub the Giant Turtle? Well, this is his egg. The local villagers pray to this giant egg every morning. It truly is the heart of Bubble Gloop Swamp, and breaking or damaging this egg in any way would really have an impact on the swamp. That's why respect is so important, and we hope anyone traveling to this world has it. Now, as part of this once in a lifetime vacation package, you'll also have the chance to meet the mayor of Bubble Loop Swamp, Mumbo. Now, being the successful businessman he is, Mumbo is your guide for anything related to real estate. He has multiple vacation homes throughout the Banjo series, and even bought his home mountain back in 1984. You go, Mumbo. Now, Mumbo loves skills, so another activity that the whole family can participate in is our daily skull scavenger hunt. Scattered throughout this swamp, you'll find multiple skulls, and if you collect enough, Mumbo will grant you one wish. Here's a clip and a testimonial from one of our most recent clients, who wish was granted and just absolutely loved spending his honeymoon in Bubble Gloop Swamp. Hey y'all, I recently had my honeymoon in Bubble Gloop Swamp, and OMG, I feel like a new person. I heard about this Mumbo character being able to grant wishes, and I knew immediately I had to take my chance to see him. The thing is, I've just always wanted to be a crocodile. And so once I got my 10 skulls, I scurried away from my wife and went straight to Mumbo. And boom, I was a crocodile, with a new outlook on life. Suddenly, I could travel through the swamp water without fear of being bitten or injured. I was planning on returning back to my human self and my wife, but then I came across Mr. Vile and found new love in my new crocodile form. Mr. Vile was so quick to show who was the boss in this relationship, but I was also quick to show him I was the hungriest by eating an all-you-eat kind of buffet of yumbies and grumblies. <laughs> We've been inseparable ever since. Thanks, Level Reviews, for recommending this great vacation package. It was our pleasure. Listen, if you want my honest opinion, 
I find Bubble Glue Swamp to be just fine. It's nothing special, and visually, it's not appealing to travel through. If you're looking for a challenge, this isn't the world for you, since collecting all the collectibles in this world is pretty easy. But there are some interesting things you can do. I personally love the memorizing of Tip Top songs, and though I'm not a fan of Mr. Vile's eating minigame, it's a pretty unique activity, especially since you have to do it while transformed. But hey, if you love green and moss, and don't mind these annoying ass bugs, then this just might be the world for you. I give Bubble Gloop Swamp a B, and for the low price of 7 jiggies and 180 notes, this package could be yours. I hope you enjoyed this video slash sales pitch. If I don't see you in Bubble Gloop Swamp, then I hope to see you in the next world, which is a personal favorite of mine. Until then, ciao!